Hello, and, um, welcome to a tutorial. Um, this tutorial, I will be going over how just to make a basic table website layout. Uh, this is going to be very simple. But, you know, I just thought I'd do it. Okay. As you can see here, I have saved this already as index.php. And I'm using Notepad. Yep. Okay, so we're going to start out with an HTML tag. HTML, okay? And then we're going to type in head as an all, eight, well, just for this one. We're going to type in head. Oh, I'm sorry. We're going to type in title. Title. And we're just going to call this tutorial uh, website. ending it ending the title tag okay um now you want to you wanna um you <coughs> I'm sorry uh you wanna end the head tag but if you wanna put a style sheet in there you can and we're actually going to do that so we're gonna type in style just like so style Type equals print oh, double quotes text slash CSS just like so. And now this is where you get fan. You can include. You can do your uh, your um style sheet on a different thing. Okay, but we're just gonna keep it on the same same stuff so we're gonna type in body for body you know which is like the basic stuff background color we're just gonna keep this white so F for hex code it's FFF for short key just like that or you can do it long like that font family we're gonna do Verdana and then if Verdana isn't available it'll switch to Arial <clears throat> so um, if Verdana if someone goes on that website and uh, they don't have the Verdana font it'll go to Arial and if they don't have the Arial font it'll switch to the default which is Times New Roman which is not very exciting <laughs> okay um color obviously have to be black cuz you know I just wouldn't go with it um font size i think the default's like 12 points but we're going to set it to 10 because 10 cool we're just going to end it we're just going to keep that oops we're just going to keep it like that for now we might add some more stuff into the CSS. <clears throat> now you want to start your body tag, which is all the text goes into. Um now we're going we're going this is a table layout because it would just be crazy if we didn't have a table or you could use div layers. But this is that's a whole different tutorial. Okay. <sighs> table So, oh, by the way, if you wanted to get fancy with it, you could just type in table like this. You won't have to do a class or an ID. This is a ID and this is a class. Just to refresh your memory. Cell spacing equals three. I like to have three. Cell padding equals three. Oh, three is also. Okay. TR T oh yeah. And in my in my table tutorial I um I didn't end the T R and T D because you know I really didn't feel like it at the time. But I'm going to end all my T R and T D just to be organized and try and be professional. 
Okay. And while you were, I took a pause there. While you weren't looking, I just changed the title. So it's website, basic website layout. Okay. T R T D. Just like that. This is going to be our header, so we better align this to the right. And I'm sure it's going to have a coal span, too. Because I'm sure there's going to be two columns at least. So you just want to do this like so, and you just want to type in header. So you know where that goes. You just want to end the TD, and you want to end the TR. TD stands for table data table data and TR stands for table of row table row just to get that through okay <clears throat> another TR TD um we have to have a navigation bar don't we align equal center and this is also going to be a call span of it's going to be a oh Whole span of equal to, okay? Huh. I can't type today. We're just gonna type in navigation and the TD, and then you want to end the TR. TR TD. Um. This is like gonna be a picture or something. Um Okay, and for this one, it's just going to be a picture here, so I'll just type an image. TD instead of TRTD, we're just going to put TD. And then we're just going to type in blah 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 and the TD then you want to end the table cause uh... you know by the way I like to space out everything I do so someone got me into have it we're gonna save this and my WAMP should work yeah WAMP not EXAMP yeah cause EXAMP sucks doesn't it Marcus Okay, um, localhost slash tuts slash, that should be all. Oh yeah, I forgot to do something. Everything I do, I like to add a border first, but then I take it off all the time. So, yeah. Because I always make mistakes with tables. But I didn't. Oh yeah, I see it. This is aligned. Okay, I'm going to add some stuff while you guys aren't looking. Because I don't have much time. Okay, I added a width. So, it doesn't... And I'm going to add on a line. Because it'll just look stupid. If it's just a line to the left. Okay, I saved it. Okay, much better. This is where the header goes. This is where the navigation goes. This is an image. Actually, I'm in mistake. Just wait. Okay, I will fix the mistake because this blah 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 is supposed to be up here. I will fix the mistake on my next tutorial part 2 of the basic website layout. Hope you enjoyed this tutorial and I hope you have a good day. Goodbye and see you next time.